Right. So um, this is one of the websites. As you can see up here in the browser, this is the CPBF1. That just means collision prevention and um, voyage and flags. That's what the F is for. Okay. Um, Suresh, can you turn down the speakers? Because I hear in myself through the speakers, please. Okay. Right. That's better. Cool. Um, right. So you see in here on the left side, right? You following me? On the left side of the screen, right? You can go to the course catalog. Right. You click on course catalog. Course catalog on the left side. When you first go in, I'll show you how to log in in a minute. But for now, I'm just showing you how to move around inside, right? So you go to the course catalog. Each one of these boxes here, that the ones that are flipping over now, those are the lessons, right? So in this unit, there are five lessons. And there are five exams. So you, for each lesson that you do, you will do a little test on it. So to get this now, you have to come down here to this green button on the right side here and say, add it, add the module to the cart, right? So you're going through like if you're buying it, but the price is zero, so you don't have to worry about that. This bit comes up here in the middle, you say, proceed to checkout, green buttons mostly. Okay, so you do proceed to checkout. You end up on this screen again, this is your shopping cart screen. You scroll down and on the right side, same again, proceed to checkout. Okay. Right. So now you are, you're in the course. So you can do two things here. You could jump straight in and start the test, which is not a problem, right? Um, uh, especially for experienced guys, you're already working as a captain. I have no problem with that, right? So you want to jump in and see, let's just jump in and see what this test for the first one looks like. Okay. So we have something like this. The vessel is about to enter a channel where the width and depth of navigable water makes her unable to deviate from her course without going aground. In daylight, and the master instructs you to put up the signal. Which signal would you put up? Right, multiple choice in these. Okay. Um, you pick your choice, you come over on the right side here and you submit your answer. All right. You go through to the end, you can see there are 15 questions. When you reach the end, you click finish course. I get a notification. You get any number of attempts, even if you make over the 70%. You could go in again and try for 80 or 90 or 100. No, no problem with that, right? So let's stop the test and let's look at how you get to a lesson. So we stop the test and we're going back. So we're going into view course this time over here on the right side again. We're going into view course. Okay, now we see in this link here. So we click on the link. And we click on the link, this password box comes up here, but it's just password. P-A-S-S-W-R-D for all of them anywhere in any website of my hours. All right, so you click on that. And you get your first presentation. You might have to click it down here to start it. And you get your first slide. Now, people learn in different ways. If you want to read along with what I am saying or whatever, the, whoever the narrator is, I think on this one is me. Um, you have the notes over here, whatever the person saying, hello and welcome to the lights for vessels aground and whatever. Okay, so you could follow it there. 
Um, right. Hold on. Can you hear the video by any chance? Can you hear us? Sir? Are you hearing the video? Okay. Because I know here it here. Oh, right. Because I have my headphones, right? My headphones are plugged in, but I don't have them on. Right. Okay, cool. Once you're hearing them. Okay, so we could come out of this by going backwards up in the top left-hand corner here. Right? So, again, remember we said, you see in here that they're page one of six. That means that you have the videos and you have the, the test. So if you want to go to the next video, if you did this one already, you just go to next page. Okay, and this is another video. This is the video for towing now. This is showing you all the tow. This is how you would light up towed objects. So if you want to see that, you click on the link, you go in and you see it. You can move backwards. Right, previous page, that kind of thing. Right, so um, I want to show you the other website, the other one where your magnetic compass thing is. So now we're gonna go, I'm gonna show you the login. Okay, so you just put in your email. No, no, sorry, I forget. Yeah. I'm not gonna boost how I'm using it so much I remember in it and I'm feeling the wrong thing. Right, so there you are, right? Cause I used it before. Your password, like I said, is welcome. W-E-L-C-O-M-E, -E, no capitals or nothing. Click on login. All right. All right. Okay. So you need to register here. All right. I could leave that for you to do. Um, when you get in, All right. Or we could do it together now. Right, this is just where I put in all this stuff that will come out on your certificate and that kind of thing. Yeah. So I try, I really try to keep it to a minimum, boy, because, you know, you know, it is with data and stuff. I don't want to be responsible for people's data. So although it's in city, I just put in Trinidad and Tobago. <laughs> so, so really, the, the only thing I ask for is that data birth for, you know, just in case we get somebody else with the exact name. Okay, remind me, I know it's, when, when, 21st of this month, and Yeah, I remember because it was right after my mom. My mom is 17, um, 79, yeah. But it has so much scorpions in my life. I, um, I, have, a, I have a scorpion tattoo on me and all. I like to tell you how much of them are wrong, man. <laughs> and, yeah. Nah, well, watch, they're straightforward. You understand? They know what they want, and they're straightforward. They're going fit. Right, okay. So we register your account now. Um, which means I will have to verify it. If you, you know, when you, I just registered as you. So I now get an email saying to register you on this, um, on this website which I can just do quickly because we have time, I hope. Yeah, we have time. Um, so I'll just come out of being you if I can. I can not reach that part of the screen. I'm supposed to log out over there. Right, no, that's, that's no problem because we could just go back to the other one. I, I will verify when we finish this, the, 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 um, the tour. So yeah, so Pretty much, that is um, the website. And actually, sorry, say that again. No, well, here what I did. I mean, no, I have all the things together, right? And I have I have them separated out. 
Okay, so on this occasion, although because by the time you by the time you make the next payment, I just shifting you over to the next website where everything is. In fact, I'm just about to show you the next website because there's some things there. I don't know because you're an experienced guy and you study before. I don't know if you're planning to take your time and get some deep knowledge because that is available for you here. Right. Yeah, well, then let, well, let me show you some stuff that you need to, um, you really, I, I tell you this morning, is only my instinct as a teacher, buddy, is to just give you learning, right? But I run in a business too, so I just had to protect myself and I get burned in the past. But I would just like to put you on the main website and let you see everything and, you know, enjoy it. Because let, let me show you what's on the main website that, the fellas who own it yet, they didn't even realize this. I want to show you this. Um, again. Oh, no. Well, we'll go in as me, but I will. Um, don't be surprised if I tell you, just shift over to this one and start working, you know, because I feel that, that makes more sense, to be honest. Um, but let me show you. If I'm going to do that, it's because I want to give you access to this kind of stuff that them fellas ain't realize here. When I've done with you is a coastal navigation master. I want you to teach it, right? So for example, right? So this is the this is the module I just showed you, the same one about thing and voyage. Look at here again. And look the next one that you want to do, look it in here. But I want what I want fellas to start going for is Right, let me show you this. Yeah, let me watch this. All right, I'll buy this and show you. Because I, I'm going to do a lesson. I, I'm trying to organize a lesson with Duki and Story to go through this with them. Because this is what we're going to be doing in the chart work when you come to the classroom. Let me show you this book. Is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, look at here. View course. Right, so this is all your coastal navigation exercise book. This is what we call in chart work. Right, so it's a PDF. You can print this and you can start working. I will give you copy charts. I will give you a copy of the 4A3. And I will give you a copy of the, I think, 474 for this book. All right? So you go in and you start doing the exercises. The exercises start here. You answer little things like um, complete the table using down here. So you look at the picture. You look at A, B, C, D up to H. And then you come in and you see which one is which one. That is just latitude and longitude and poles and thing. Then we come here. So you see this one now. We don't need a classroom for this. You could do this out at work or at home. So this exercise too. This is where how many minutes in one degree, right? What is the latitude of the true north pole? All of that kind of stuff there, right? There are, right? Now we're starting to see. I'm showing you the latitude scale here on the side of the chart, and you have to say what is A, what is B, what is C, right? You can do all of this at home. This is what we're going to be doing in the classroom, but it can be done on board or at home. This one is for the longitude scale, and then you write in what the longitude of them thing is, right? So now we're looking at the scale away from the side of the chart. We're looking sometimes, this is over in Manzanella side there, where sometimes you just get a scale in the middle of the chart, you will be going through and testing yourself, submitting your answers, and getting feedback. Again, this one is longitude. We pass it a little bit, but that's okay. Then, this is like a chart, chart exercise. This one we have to do in the class. So now I'm telling you to find 
the November mic too well on the chart on the 483 and you know find out the latitude and longitude and write it down in here. So you need the chart for this one. Right? You go on a platform, you write it down here. Basic stuff, but it's refresher stuff. Right? Same thing here now. You're doing the opposite thing now. Now I want you to plot these positions on the chart. Right? It's building up. It's building up. Right? So this one is on the other chart. This is on the 474 four, four chart. This is the big Port of Spain chart. And you do some plotting on this one now. So that is for the classroom. Although, if I gave you the copy chart, you could do it on board. Right? So again... This one is not a chart exercise. I want you to look at the latitude and the longitude and tell me which one is the furthest north and which one is the furthest south. And same thing for the longitude, which one is the furthest west. All right? So it's them kind of. Right? Again, this one, you don't need a chart fit. How many degrees in a compass? What is the reciprocal of? Those kind of questions. Right, the compass rose question. So we start to get into the compass now, some variation and thing. Right, so I make it go on the chart and work out, do the variation change from what it have on the chart to what it is today. Right, so some nice little exercises, nothing taxing, just five of them. These here now is some big tables where you have to apply your variation and deviation, just write in the, fill in the blanks. Right, so plenty practice. Plenty good practice, right? So that one, right? So you see what we just do there? I want to do that with um, Duki and Story this week on board, right? I want to show you something else that you're supposed to like even more than this. I wrote, anyway, it doesn't matter why I did it, but okay. Um, here's a little gift for the fellas following me in this industry. I want to go back to the course catalog now and buy something else. Ah, and it will give me the chance to show you something too. How are you doing, sir? You good? All right, cool. You're songing far. <laughs> That's the only thing. So, right. So we're going back in the course catalog. And this time, I'm going to choose... This one, the passage planning. All right, so we add in the passage planning. You see, here what coastal guys don't do, do understand. Eh? I mean, a lot of them, hear what you need to appreciate about what you do. I was a deep sea seaman. And you see, when we come on the coast, that is when we used to say we really navigated. Right? We just double up, we just get lively when we're on the coast. So, all you're not working in an area where people had a relax, all is the better navigators. Deep sea easy, sat nav doing everything, you're just making sure the ship following the line. But what all it is do, you need to be a crack shot. And that is where I want all it to be. All right, this thing's still loading, but now nah, bear with me, it's worth it. Right, I'm going now. Right, proceed to cart, and then you will get to see what the system does do when you have one course open and you try to open my next one. It seem like a problem, but it's not. It, it have one button alone to fix it. So I'm trying to buy this one now. I'm going to proceed to check out. go passage planning yeah here we go view course come in okay right so you see this comes up it says simultaneous courses are not allowed. Don't worry about that. Right? So you could either go back to the book we were just looking at, or we could finish the book we were just looking at and start this one. Right? You could see that plenty. 
but don't let it fret you. See how easy it is? All right. So, should help me wrong thing. <laughs> now, this is one of the videos about Viz Bridge Resource Management. And yeah, this is one of the passage planning videos. No go areas. Is a key element uh, that of kind of thing, but I, I know what I bring in here to look at, although that is cool. Um, right, we're going to the next page. Right, this one, this, this lesson is about keeping charts up to date, chart corrections and stuff. Right, this one is na all about navigational warnings. Right, this is all the charts around Trinidad and different chart skills and all of that kind of stuff. Some cool lessons in here. This is about the um, the pilot books or the sailing directions. You're supposed to know that inside out on the coast here. I don't want them foreigners coming here and knowing more about we coast than we boys. That is why these lessons are so deep. Well, they must be masters of this coast. See this lesson here, what we're looking at here is selecting waypoints from Balandra to Grand Revere which means around um, Toko, Galera point there. So you get a little advice and thing, how to do your passage planning. This one is Carnage to point 14, right? So you had to come through the book. No, Carnage to point 14 is just coming down here. That's a normal run. Um, Quinam to Cedrus, a passage plan, Quinam to Cedrus. So that means you had to pass through the serpent's mouth, right? This one is Maracas to point Kumana. So you will do um, the bookers. This is a this is a lesson. Huh? Yeah, that's right. To see every lesson, that's right. So there's twelve lessons here. Yeah, that's right. In fact, I didn't find I didn't find what I thought was in here, what I was really looking to show you. But I end up going through the lessons. But you understand the level, uh, the level that we're going at. So when you're doing cal, this la that's right, yeah. And you're in the lesson. So look, and I'll click on this one here for the lesson on calculating course and distance. Right. So if we go in there, um, you can see we're doing an example where we're taking it from the canteen platform to the point setter platform and that is kind of how the lessons go show you the dividers you use parallel rules right how to operate with egg. well not really how to operate i'll let you know about egg this and the trackball you plot your course how to put it in the gps telling you i want all you to run this course the next generation must run this course they mustn't bring in no foreigners here better than all you bring in the boat and all you go walk it that's what we're talking about. I've already said everything. So, yeah, so difference in latitude, how to use the tables to work out your distances, um, all that kind of thing. So, you just need to look up the latitude and longitude of the port you're going and then make your, um, right, make your calculations and stuff, all of that in there. And imagine, and then it has the advance. Uh, besides that, it had the advance. So, you know, so that is a good look around um, how the websites work and what is there and get rid of the noise. Right. So, you have any questions for me, sir? I hardly 